former president John Romani Mahama has scoffed at the NPP administration's implementation of the One Village One Dam initiative, describing it as a monumental waste of the taxpayers' money. He says most of the dugouts constructed under the program have no water in them and that the few viable ones had could only serve a few cattle, addressing a deba held in his home at Mangwe in the Wa East District. Mahama stated that the era of juicy promises couched with flowery language is gone, adding that Ghanaians are wide awake and will reject politicians who come to them with such promises. Joy News' Upper West Regional Correspondent Rafiq Salam is on the campaign trail with the former president and reports from Bolenge. Former President John Dramani Mahama rolled out of the one municipality and heading to Logo in the Wa East constituency on the second day campaign tour of the Upper West Region. On reaching Boli, located at the outskirts of the one municipality, residents of the community blocked the main road and insisted that he address them or they wouldn't allow him to proceed. Due to the rainy, muddy and slippery nature of the ground, his security advised that he address the residents from the top of his vehicle, but they wouldn't have any of that. Mr. Mahama finally came down, promised to fix the deplorable road, and also upgrade their clinic to the status of a polyclinic, should he be re-elected in the December polls. Mr. Mahama, after that, had the opportunity of continuing the whistle stop tour and met with the chiefs and people of the local traditional area. He was enskinned as a sub chief under the skin name Logo Dondolina. Mr. Mahama then moved further north and to Mangwe, where he was enskinned as a Masiemana. Masiema is an important asset of the Mangwe traditional area where people used to seek refuge during times of crisis. It is our belief that we are in times of crisis and we are, faced, we are in times of crisis as a nation and it is important to go back to Masiama for refuge. Mr. Mama stated that the MPP then in opposition came to the people with juicy promises and Ghanaians bought into that. He noted that that era is gone and Ghanaians are wide awake. Elections are coming. People are going to come with sweet promises again. But this time, Ghanaians are wide awake. We shall not fall to false promises anymore. We know the party we trust. NDC promises and delivers. We will not say what we cannot do. We identify what the felt needs of the people are, and when we promise that when we come, we're going to resolve those issues, that is exactly what we deliver. He mocked at the implementation of the One Village One Down program of the MPP, saying it is a monumental waste of the taxpayers' money. Stuck out. When the minority went round to inspect the dugouts, in January, February, most of them were dry. There was no water in them. Even a few cars all the water in the one village, one dam. So the one village, one dam has been a monumental waste of taxpayers' money. With that dams, under the Ghana Social Opportunity Program. You should go and see the dams we did under GSO. Massive holding water throughout the year. Good for irrigation purposes. The former president rounded his tour of the War East constituency at Bulingi. Like the people of Loho, they are craving for the creation of a new district out of the current War East district to speed up development in the area. Mr. Mahama promised to look into the issue should he be given the nod in the 2020 polls. For the third consecutive time and on the tour, Mr. Mahama was honored by the chiefs and people of the Bulaga traditional area with another chieftain's title under the skin name Yimalina, meaning development chief. Reporting for the news, 
Rafik Salam. <laughs>